Yo guys, what's up? It's Sony Vegas Edits here, coming at you with uh, another tutorial. Finally, I'm back. Uh, my mic broke. I actually got a new one, so I'm just repositioning myself. Just sick. Yeah, so I finally got a new mic, and it's really good. And yeah, so today I'm gonna be doing a tutorial in After Effects about how to get like um. If you've seen my uh, OCE about my on my terminal clip. It's similar to that, but it's going more advanced about the color flashes. There's going to be screen pumping involved, and also like this uh, CC uh, light burst or whatever. So yeah, let's get into it. Open up your After Effects. Mm, yeah, so just double click uh, the project area to import your uh, file. I'm just going to use the same one as I used in my OCE. And also, I just got some techno music. I think it's the music from Parallel, actually. I th yeah, I think it is. But, yeah, that's just a really good example of music, so I'm just going to go ahead and drag that in. Um, and, yeah. So, let's just... Okay. So, first, what we're going to do is, actually, we are going to just... Uh, go click on the music and hit double L, LL. And what this does is it brings out the waveform... So yeah, we're going to actually find some nice beats right here, and we're going to mark them. And how you do that is, you can either hit Shift-8 uh, on your keyboard, and that creates one. Like, go right... Um, wait a second. Just wait one sec. Oh my god, my computer. Okay, there we go. Okay, so just... You could right here about you could either hit shift 8 shift 8 oh my god yo my computer is so annoying okay but sh uh, where to go what happened what happened okay shift 8 and that creates a little keyframe or you could go to the side here and just kind of drag them I prefer to kind of just drag them it's a bit easier and we're just gonna find some beats like uh yeah Uh, and then we're gonna go right here. We're gonna add another one. This tutorial may take a while, actually. Uh, so just add another one. Uh, there. And then we're just gonna do one more. Uh, right there. This big one right here. <laughs> Sorry, my computer's super shitty. I'm getting a new laptop soon. Can't wait, because I'm fed up with this computer. Like, I, like, basically quit editing for a while because this computer's really shitty. And it takes forever to render. But, yeah. I'm also going to show you a little, uh, an example. Like, I'm going to actually render this out and show you what it, the final outcome is. Like, okay, so now we got the keyframes down. We're going to do the screen pumping. And how we're going to do that is, actually a really neat effect is if you hit sheet and you hit shift and you have these uh, markers here, if you hit shift and you click anywhere near it, it snaps right into the middle of it. So if you go like that, snapping into the middle, snap, snap. And that makes it really, really helpful within uh, syncing all of this stuff properly. So snap it there. Uh, we're going to go to the clip, hit S for scale. We're actually going to bump this up to 104. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, actually, what we're going to do first... Whoops, what the hell? Oh, fuck. So let's just go 104. Okay, you're going to... Once you're in the middle of your uh, keyframe, go one keyframe back. Just hit the little keyframe back thing. And then we're going to have this 104, so keyframe it. Then go back one ahead and put it to about 115 let's just do 115 and then can shift click around the keyframe snap it go back one frame back to 104 go ahead one back to 115 it's a lot of keyframing I mean if you don't know how to keyframe suggest go watch some simple tutorials on how to do that stuff before you go into this advanced so we're just gonna keep a uh, snap into the uh, the marker 
hitting, going on our con time controls, going back one keyframe, winding it to 104, enter, going back to the middle of the uh, snap thing, and then going to 115. And then let's just do this one more time. One more time. Oh, we got. What the hell? Why didn't it snap? Why didn't it fucking snap? Oh, it did. Never mind. Okay. Back one. And then snap. I might have to break this up into sections. Fuck it. Fifteen. Okay, so now that we got the screen pumping, pumping finally done, we're gonna do right, right click, and we're gonna do the fl the flashes, the rainbow flash. So right click, new adjustment layer. Got this adjustment layer over it. And we're gonna go to our video effects and hit four, oops, four dash for four col dash color gradient, and just drag that over. Um, the thing, and we're gonna come up with this. And what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna add it. Ooh, doesn't that not look fucking sexy, man? That shit looks sexy. Just kidding. Sorry, sorry. I just, you know, I get excited, man. <laughs> uh, why? Okay, let's just see here. Money mode. What happened? What is? What the heck? There we go. Okay, there we go. That's what was fucked up. Okay, so we're gonna add it. Kinda looks a bit ugly right now. Right now. Okay. <laughs> but what we are going to do now is pass it. Uh, what the heck? Okay. So now we're gonna snap it to here. Why is this so ugly looking okay we'll just have that for now oh yeah okay oh yeah I know so we're gonna have this snap go back opacity zero no z what the heck happened opacity zero keyframe it move ahead and then we are going to opacity it to a hundred and then we're gonna snap it back one zero same thing as the pump screen that we're doing right now snap it so it's the exact same as before. Um, okay. So now what we got, we got these flashes going on. And uh, yes, yeah, so it's like flashing real nice. Okay, to the beat. To the beat. Don't forget, it's to the beat. Okay, yeah, right. I'm just going to do one more thing just so it could stop. Like right there. S snap it. And then pass it to zero. There we go. Okay, so now that we got that shit done. And we also got to do the scale part. Okay. Um, S. To 104. Okay, here we go. Now we're now we going down. Now the shit go down. Okay, so last thing, last thing we're gonna do, and we're just gonna put this straight on the uh, clip itself, is we're gonna go CC light light burst. CC light burst 2.5. Now this shit, this shit is the shit, man. I mean, look at this shit. Look how this shit though. Boom. Look at that. Oh, 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 that's sexy. Girl, what's up with that? That's hot. That's hot. <laughs> Sorry. So we're going to go, same thing, exact same thing. We're going to, wait, did I put this? Okay, yeah, screw, my bad. We want this on the uh, actual clip. So snap, 
Same thing, my niggas. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Same exact same thing. We actually want this 200. Let's do that 200 shit, man. And then we'll do that like 100. Boom. That's sexy. So we're gonna actually um right here we're gonna want it to have zero. So it's not in length ray. So let's just go down to the clip now. Uh FX boom. And then go m move on a hundred no about f yeah, let's go seventy, let's say seventy. And then snap it. Same thing, yo. This this thing all it does is it ta this part takes patience, you know? Because it ta like I know it takes a while, but you just got to learn to go with the flow. It takes patience. And a real editor will have the time for this. And the thing I love about these markers is it makes it so everything is synced up so nicely and perfectly, and it's really nice. It makes it it like finishes it. Up. You know what I mean? It makes it really nice. It makes it stand out. It makes it professional. Even though I'm not that good of an editor, but you know that 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 shit is that's beside the point. What happened to the fucking clip? What happened? What the fuck, yo? All the clips over. Shit. Dang, son. I didn't even notice. Shit. Fuck. Damn it, what the hell? Why is this all fucked up now? Why is this? What the hell happened to my... Let's just go back. There we go, fuck. What the, I don't even know what the hell just happened. Okay, so, and then... Yeah, what the heck? Let's just see here. This is the right... Sorry, guys. Fuck, hey? So... Sorry about this, guys. I'm just gonna. Okay, one keyframe up. Uh, all right, we're back on track now. Okay, there, there we go. And then just snap it. Uh, one there, zero. And then, like, I mean, you could stop right here. Um, if you want, I'm just gonna finish it off for you guys. But uh, this is basically it. It's a lot of keyframing, a lot of uh, simple stuff. And then here we're just gonna uh, finish it off by um, going back to th there. So now we have everything finished. Uh, uh, yeah, so I'll try to ramp here review this. I don't know if it'll work because my computer sucks. But yeah, so let's just see if this works. And if not, if this don't work, I'll just cut this part from the video. So yeah. So that is how you do that shit. Uh, oopsies. My bad. Shit, him. Okay. Yeah, you know what? I'll just render it and then uh, do it at, put it at the beginning. basically it so peace out guys Sony Vegas said it's uh, leave a comment actually you know I'm gonna be doing another tutorial tonight yes tonight maybe tonight yes tonight okay because 